passionate. I work hard to win it, pop it in on accident. Yeah, I'm always on go, better watch your watch. Hello, loves. Welcome back to the channel. So I am bringing you another weekly ASOF haul. Now, this haul consists mostly of dresses, which I absolutely love, especially for this time of year. And I know we're mostly indoors around this time, so it's completely understandable. We're not even excited about dresses and excited about all the summer bikinis we bought. But just me being a lover of fashion, I'm really excited about clothes in general. So this is definitely something where I will wear to our Sunday game nights at my mom's house. Um, just something really chill, really casual, and really cute. Um, it still has that, of course, nice flare at the bottom there. But it's simple. But before we get into the dresses, let me give you a little bit of, um, I guess, housekeeping. So, of course, I do have that coupon code, which saves you a bunch. I feel like it's a nice coupon code, y'all. So, it's D-White25. I'll have it pop up on the screen somewhere. Also, please, everything will be down below. Link down below. If it's out of stock, I won't link it. Or it'll just take you to the main page if it goes out of stock something else i wanted to mention oh please keep in mind i do have the fundraiser on all of my videos now so it's in support of black lives matter and the money goes directly to the naacp um again if you can't support that way i know a lot of people are saying sign petitions and all that i know a lot of people think petitions don't work but petitions help to reopen cases in some cases i didn't really want to say cases but in some instances petitions do help to um bring justice or at least revisit certain cases so i just wanted to go ahead and mention that um and lastly i do want to thank asaw for being a sponsor of my new business i want to be so thank you so much asaw and of course i did partner with asaw to bring you this video so let's go ahead and hop into the haul. This first dress here is really, really cute. Really simple at the top, scoop neck, short sleeve. It's not tight, it's not constricted. It's just really, really, um, it's comfy, but that's not the word I was looking for. I know it has a slight stretch to it, like it has stretch to it. It is like a lightweight material, like a cotton material. Um, and then it does have pockets, which I absolutely love. And then I love navy blue. I just love navy blue. It's one of my favorite blues. Um, but yeah, love this shade of blue. Love this dress. It's really simple. You don't have to do too much. A pair of sandals, maybe some jewelry. Um, I think this actually look really cute with your hair up or down. It's just one of those dresses. So yeah, um, the ruffle detail, at first I was like, I don't know how I'm going to feel about it. But it gives it a little flair because if it didn't have that, I don't know if I would really like this dress as much as I do. So um, yeah, I really like that about it. Again, it's not constricting so you don't have to really worry about underneath um me personally and someone asked about this in a previous video spandex shorts are always for me when i'm wearing a dress unless i'm like going out to the club and even then and i don't really go out to the club i'm just saying that for instance but even then i don't really like wearing dresses or skirts without spandex shorts because people are really creeps and then i just don't want everything just shaking everywhere so um yeah this length it's not too short for me but I was still, again, just put on a pair of spandex shorts. And I get them from random places. Um, they're not necessarily shapewear. It's just something that you can throw on underneath, like a mini biker short or cycling short. So the back of this dress does seem, um, it's not really short. But I feel like if I was to bend over, it might be short. But, um, you know, you might see something. But hopefully if you're wearing a dress, you're not bending over and you know you're doing a squat to pick something up or to do your shoe or whatever the case is so that's the back of this i really like this and i definitely think it's appropriate for like um a family occasion or just a fun chill occasion with your friends um even running to the grocery store sometimes you want to be cute that's the only thing we doing nowadays anyway <laughs> but um yeah sometimes you just want to be cute and uh you know look somewhat put together all right, so now we have this really comfortable olive green dress. I absolutely love this. Now, typically, when I do a maxi, it's usually, like, fitted up here, and then it'll, like, flare out at the bottom, um, and it's super long. But this one has, like, a nice scoop at the bottom. Um, it just, it's really cute. It's really cozy. Um, the model actually had it belted, so I really liked it that way, but it doesn't look too bad this way. And um, it's something I wanted to compare this to. 
that black asof dress that i had with the wide sleeves the wide openings here this is also one of those things where you can throw it on you know check the mail take the dog out chill outside in the front um, walk around the house and it's really comfortable you don't feel constricted it doesn't stick to you and all that good stuff so i love pieces like this for even if i'm not going out even if it is just me chilling around the house um so i don't get nightgown vibes necessarily but i do get cozy chill relaxed vibes even if you're on vacation type of vibe so yeah and i think to dress it up i would definitely probably belt it and it's so funny i always talk about belts but i rarely do it because i don't have that many decorative belts i have like a jewel one then i have like the really thick ones i don't really have like just the cute ones to wrap around you know so i need to get me some but the length of this of course it comes to my ankle you have a slight slits on the side right there but it does come to my ankle it's really really comfortable again um it is lightweight and it does kind of flow with you at the bottom so i really like this and the top is like a little wider it has like a slight v to it but it is wider it shows more um than that last dress was showing so that is this dress here really really comfortable and of course i love the fact that it has the pockets on here so now we have this one, which I really love this shade of blue. Um, let me mention something real quick too, because I realize like I like to stand like this because it's comfortable. But people are like, oh my gosh, what's up with the one leg? It looks so com um uncomfortable. Like, uh, y'all, like. Anywho, so let me stand on two feet for those um people. But yeah, I really, really like this dress. I love the color. I love this shade of blue. I think it looks really really nice on my skin tone um and then the dress itself now i have on granny panties but the dress seems to kind of you know contour to you and you know shape to you and all that good stuff it just really um sticks to your skin but not in an uncomfortable way i don't know like it sticks to you but not in a bad way not in a way where it feels like whoo honey i don't know if i can eat a big meal um in this dress but it doesn't seem like that it just seems to really you know glide on and just you know contour to your body as i mentioned so i really do like that i love the sleeve on here you do have some more room in here and then the uh, material itself is stretched so um i do love that aspect of it it's just a really again all of these have been really comfortable so far so then it also has this belt detail which you can take off or leave on i do like the idea of having the belt here um and then the boob part is really really nice i love the way it is because it allows me to still wear a bra um and be secure with that and it not show through so i really really love that aspect of it but yeah this dress right here is a winner it's a keeper for sure one thing it does have that i typically don't like and that is a back slit so i don't like slits in the back of my dresses because one they easily rip two sometimes they go up too high and exposes too much of your backside so i don't really like back slits but this one seems to have been done in a really like classy way um which still keeps this dress being like really delicate i think the shade of blue really makes it delicate delicate i think i'm i said it right delicate <laughs> it sounds like i'm saying delicate but anywho um yeah it makes it delicate it makes it elegant i really really love this dress here oh so I love this more than I thought I would love it. I was like, eh, on the model, it was actually really, really cute. So, but you know, sometimes things that look on a model, the way they look on the model, you're like, okay, but I know that's not really going to look like that on me. But I absolutely love this. This is really, really cute. I'm really excited about the back because it's not too short. But I love having that like one detail with the leg out. Um, and you can control, you know, how high or low you want this part. But I think the way it came is actually a perfect, like, amount of thigh showing. Gives you that nice sexiness, the bottom ruffle type. It's like a, I wouldn't call it mermaid, but it's like, it flares out at the bottom. It has a nice ruffling effect. It just looks really, really nice and it makes it really, really flirty. So I can see this being like a dancing dress or, you know, just something fun and flirty that you can wear out. It's a cute black dress now. It's not necessarily a LBD because it's not, you know, short and tight. And typically that's what you see with the LBD. But it's still really, really cute. And I like that. I think it's a play on a little black dress. 
so um also with this dress i also love the um neckline here now with this one it does seem to show my bra a little bit so i would wear like a bra that cuts in a little bit more um if i was to wear a bra with this i would probably but yeah um and then the material is like it's not super stretchy like you can stretch it a little bit over your butt and stuff but it's not really really stretchy um outside of the waistband so i like this the sleeves are really really cute the material is really really comfortable and come on asap like all of these dresses have had really comfortable materials so i'm debating with this one like i want to keep it but i'm not sure but then on the back as you can see it is long enough for me i appreciate that part of it because this could have easily been like mad short but i love the asymmetry of it um is that what you call it the ace did i did i get that right but no i love the symmetry of the dress and how it kind of goes on a diagonal with the slit and all that good stuff so that is this one here let me stand straight up for y'all you see it you see it <laughs> So I love this color as well. So clearly y'all picked some good colors in this haul. But the comfort of this dress right here is crazy. Um, it's just, I don't know. I feel like as I get older, look, I'm 26 now, so I can say that. But as I get older, you know, I'm looking more so for, I really love cute things. Yes, I do. But I really, really love comfortable things. So this is definitely one of those dresses. The belt is attached to the dress, so you can't remove it outside of, you know, cutting it off. But I think it adds a nice touch. It makes it just a little more cute. You can cinch in the waist just a little bit more if you so choose to. But it's just that one extra detail that's really cute on a dress. So again, love this shade of yeah green yeah we'll call it green it is green um it does have pockets which is really really comfortable so i'm gonna go into my little stance because y'all know <laughs> that's what i do but no um love the pockets on here this dress does cling to the skin a little bit more so definitely you see booty dimples and all that i saw in the olive green dress that also showed like some dimples and stuff on the back part um definitely show where my panty line stopped in the front so that is a thing but um it's okay because like even with that i would wear not necessarily shorts but at least three quarter length leggings just because i don't want to wiggle and jiggle but with this one here i would definitely just throw on a pair of shorts and call it a day but it's really comfortable and it's really really cute one of, one of those things that i can see being worn with sneakers sandals um i wouldn't wear heels with this i don't think it's that type of classy dress but i do think it can be cute or just comfortable and casual so then we have the back, which again, I love the length. So the length is really good. The length has been really good on these dresses. Um, but again, you do see like dimples and stuff and panty lines. So that's exactly why I would wear a pair of spandex shorts. So that is this number here. Okay, so another blue. So I liked all the blues from this haul here. The navy, was that like a periwinkle? And then we have like this royal blue. Really, really cute or like cobalt what's the other one so royal cobalt and like citron citron something like that but anywho that doesn't matter i really like this now um it's simple it's plain definitely one of those things where um throwing a spanx with it because it's really really lightweight it's really um thin so you're gonna see any type of anything underneath so this is one of the things that came with a mask and um i wasn't sure how to feel about that but at this point at this day um you know this is not the new normal but the new normal like you definitely need to protect yourself so if you're going out whether it's an event and i don't know if people are still having events i know people are still out there but um if you're going out um i would definitely say hey why not make it fashionable but i do understand where people are like okay y'all make it matching sets with face masks nowadays but just like for instance i went out yesterday i had went and got my brother's gift i went to a couple of stores um and then i had went to my parents house to you know for game night so it was like you know i had to find an outfit that actually i didn't have to but i chose an outfit that actually matched my face mask and i was like you know this is literally what we're doing now so i just didn't know how to feel about it but this one does come with a face mask now this isn't probably going to protect you medically so it's like almost just for fashion and i don't really know how to feel about that but um 
it looks like this and I don't like face masks because I can't uh, it's just like I can't take stuff on my face all the time so yeah that's this and you know like I said don't necessarily know how to feel about it but it is what it is um the only thing I would say is if you're gonna do a face mask set to actually have face mask that's gonna actually protect you so yeah the back of this dress again it is kind of lightweight so you do see panty lines but that's this one here love this color come on now come on so um this one here I was like I saw it on a model and I actually seen it um on Instagram I'm just like I don't know I just mm, one of those things where it's just like mm. But, you know, sometimes we are scared of stripes. We're scared of any type of print because we just think we're going to look, um, you know, some people fear looking bigger. And I'm just like, well, you know, hey, it is what it is. <laughs> you know, I don't care about having a lot of material, having some ruffles, having this, having that. If I look, quote unquote, bigger, then I just look bigger. But I'm going to look cute, right? So this right here, I absolutely love. I know a lot of people say, don't do vertical stripes. But this is one instance where... Um, the vertical stripes are a hit okay because sometimes it, it do look like that it do be like your stripes not really going straight up and down because you have curves to your body um and you know people have their opinions but honey this is really really nice and even if it was fitted I would still wear it with the vertical stripes but I absolutely love this I love the half and half this one is like the nude this is like the black and white it's just really really cute one thing I will say is this dress is sheer so if you're gonna wear it and you don't want your undergarments being seen i would definitely recommend wearing like a black tank dress or a black bandeau and black mini skirt or long skirt it's just so cute um i'm just ready to wear it like and this is one of the things where i was like okay well i'll get it and try it because my viewers might be interested but no i got it tried it and i absolutely loved it so that's this here i can definitely see it being brunch mode vacation mode just really really cute so um i do have a thing where i don't want to keep a lot of things from my hauls just because you know my closet already looks crazy so um i'm actually just wanting to go through my closet again a lot of people asking about the closet sales and stuff that will be july so here's the back of this right here again it is sheer so you may see my underwear but it's really 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 cute um i absolutely love this and i just really didn't think i would like it at all so the buttons are functional you can make it you know a little sexier if you want to have a little more cleavage showing or you can button it all the way up and have it that way so if i'm not mistaken um yeah it is functional all the way down so you can definitely take this off um unbutton all the buttons and wear it as just like a kimono slash duster that would be really really cute as well and have like a black tank underneath or have a pair of jeans and a bandeau underneath so this can be worn versatile or multiple ways and i absolutely love this right here oh so this is one of the things where i was like i don't care if it doesn't work as a dress I will wear it as a shirt, I will wear it as a cover up, a duster, whatever. I just really love the color here. It's so freaking pretty. Um, and it actually somewhat works as a dress for me. I will say, if you get close, you'll be like, okay, them buttons, um, I don't know about all of that. But it's like a stretchy type of material. It does stretch or whatever. But just buttons in general, typically button down dresses just don't work for me. That stripe one worked really well because there is so much material. But this one on me is a little more fitted. On some, it may look a little, um, what do you call it, flirty, like fun, fit and flare. Um, fit at the top, flare at the bottom. But on me, it does kind of look like almost bodycon. Like I have a little flare, but not much. Absolutely love this. And I'm like, I'm definitely wearing it. Definitely keeping it. I just really, really love the colors in this dress. The pattern is really nice. It does have these pockets up here, which are really cute. Um, the belt also throws it off a little bit. Not throws off the dress, but throws off the front where the buttons begin to look like, okay, they may be buckling like a little bit. But I absolutely love this and definitely keeping it. It's just so, so cute. So that is this dress here. The length in the back is not bad at all. That's what I was really nervous about. Would it ride up? Would it um, be too short? is it even flattering on and i will say 
this color this <laughs> it's just so cute this style is really really cute one of my favorite things of course to come up out of asof in the belt is detachable but i would definitely leave it on but no seriously this just doesn't work for me after all the being delicate and trying to stretch it on to me it just doesn't work but the concept of this jumpsuit was really really pretty i love the side cutouts love the daintiness of the top does have a, um, a wire here so you know to hold your girls up supposedly um the straps are adjustable but this just doesn't work for me couldn't turn around if i wanted to <laughs> um the whole back i just didn't button it i mean zip it up or anything so yeah this just didn't work um but i was already like when i took it out i was like oh i don't know it stretches but it's a constricted stretch it's just not gonna work okay well for me anyway so yeah that's this the concept was really pretty though like it's real cute so here we have this jumpsuit where i feel like it is meant to be worn without a bra the straps are adjustable the drawstring is not functional it does have pockets which is really really cute the material itself does have like some stretch to it it just um it's really comfy but the no bra part might get a lot of people just because it is like you know it's like no support up here and you would kind of just be bouncing all around town when you wear it but i could see myself definitely wearing this around but the thing is i don't want to have so many clothes that i kind of wear more so for lounging rather than going out and all that good stuff so yeah i like this but if i were to wear it i would probably without a bra I wear it around the house and if i go out with it i will wear like my nude strapless bra just because i feel like it's just i don't know so then in the back um i do feel like it kind of tugs down a little bit with the draw well where the waist is supposed to be i feel like it should be up a little bit higher so i do feel like you know my butt kind of pulls it down but that's this jumpsuit here i do love the color of it and i do love the comfort of it but um it's just the boob part that gets me and um if i didn't mention the straps are adjustable i think i mentioned that so here we have the last top here which is so freaking pretty love the sweetheart neckline there's no like wire or anything it's just so comfy does have this like flared out detail here now i won't necessarily discuss the bottoms because they will be featured in a different haul but yeah i absolutely love 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 this top love the flare and flirtiness of it so yeah the i absolutely back. love this i think it's the cutest thing ever definitely want to keep this around even if for only one outfit so that's this item here i hope you guys enjoyed this week's asop haul i absolutely love this haul might be one of my favorites i just really love those two dresses one the stripes two the freaking colorful one and i'm definitely keeping that blue and that green even if only again for one outfit i definitely want to hold on to it at least you know at least 10 days at least be like okay now really decide what you're going to do with it so anywho thank you guys so much for joining again that coupon code is d-white25 it is getting toasty in here i have everything linked down below if it's not available i won't link it or when you click the link it'll just go to the main page of asop so that'll just let you know that the item is sold out so yeah i hope you guys enjoyed and again this was one of my favorite asop hauls